welcome. So we're here in Bethesda, looking at the uh, Stroh Snyder's hardware store. The line inside is around the entire store. And they're bringing out crates of snow shovels. As we speak. Welcome. Toasting. We're live in Bethesda. It's a single piece. And snow shovels are going like hotcakes. The we're at the outside of uh, the Strohsteiner's Hardware Store in Bethesda, Maryland. And they keep bringing out crates and crates the snow shovels. The line inside the store is around the store. Uh, they have boxes and boxes of salt. Stro Snyder's hardware. This is not just an this one. Just this one. Tempers are short in the uh, Stroh Snyder's parking lot here. Uh, lines, lines are uh, basically gridlock inside the parking lot. But uh, this store is doing a good job of keeping the salt and uh, keeping the shovels going. I'm asking people, will you be able to just right side? How long? How long's the run been going on today? Is it crazy? Is it, have you ever seen a crazier day? It started before I got here. No, this is the craziest I've seen. Crazy. How many snow shovels will you sell today? I can even count. I can even count. I mean, I probably put about three pilots, four pilots out this morning and see what's left over there. How many more do you got? Oh, we got more. Hey. <laughs> How you doing? I'm fine, thanks. Well, you got everything you need? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I just spent uh, I just spent forty dollars on bird seed. That's how crazy it is. <laughs> Good to see you. See, people are even taking two shovels. That's how that's how crazy it is. Some people are one shovel's not enough. The snow's so deep, you need two sleds, I think. <laughs> Brian. <laughs> See, look, three shovels. That's. So, so once again, we're here in Bethesda. We're uh, looking at approximately, uh, it just changed the forecast, between uh, 30 to uh, 40 inches of snow uh, 20, on the boom side. You're not, you're not part. You're not part of it. Find something else, please. You're not part of it. So again, we're uh, here in Bethesda at the Stroh Snyder's Hardware Store. Uh, parking's pretty much uh, pretty much uh, gridlock trying to uh, find a parking space here. Uh, they have got the uh, salt pallets and the uh, shovel pallets out. Well, it does snow every year, but we uh, this is, has the potential, they say, of being historic. Uh, snow and this is pretty much. Don't look at me, I'm just getting a holler because it's Shabbat. Good, excellent, excellent. <laughs> you think people have shovels, but uh, a lot of us don't. Or you need a fresh one. You're going to need a good, sh solid shovel for this snow. 30% uh, chance uh, 
The Washington Post says 30 to 40 percent chance of a boom scenario, which would be 40 plus inches. And we've never seen uh, that much here since I've been here in 30 years. Yeah, for the most part, people are are controlled. There's been a few little traffic accidents out. Here's the guy bringing out shovel after shovel. And, yeah, if you work right across from this place, then uh, just to, I think they're supposed to uh, start snowing today uh, a little around noon. And I saw one of the models last night watching the weather blogs. Uh, that there was some thunder snow predicted uh, during the night and uh, maybe up to five inches an hour at a few points. So the meteorologists are just nuts. They've never seen models like this. Uh, they've never seen a scenar some of the scenarios. Yeah, I think we all never met a blizzard I haven't liked uh, myself, even though it means uh, the aftermath is, is always uh, a few days off from school, yeah. kids go crazy. Like I want a sled, but... So, not a lot of news, but you can get a sense of what it's like here. A lot of energy, people are behaving themselves. Again, uh, Channel 9's inside the hardware store here, uh, talking to people about what they forgot. Uh, the line is clear, completely around the inside of the store. Uh, here's the guy putting out the salt bags. Firewood. And... The wood's right here. Yeah, you can tell them inside, but it's right here. You can grab it. The wood supply right here. And then. Yeah, that's the, another thing is you just go and say, inside and say you want the 50 pound bag at 8300. We can load you up if you want to put your part right here. And then. We got yes. the salt ready to go. Yes, sure. So you want to get it or you want to take it to Okay. Yeah. Yes, in Bethesda. At the uh, at the Stroh hardware store here off of Arlington. Yeah. Yeah, great business. They're they're doing a good job. They've got all hands on deck. The line's incredibly long, but it's moving really, really fast inside. Uh, yeah, yeah. So it's a mixture of. Yeah, in Toronto, you guys are uh, you guys are used to it. Uh, we got a storm like this. This this could be the all-time record breaker for DC. I'm seeing some of the folks uh, compared to the Knickerbocker storm. It's not it's not panic. <laughs> it's uh it's uh excitement and uh and people are taking it seriously i think the i think the capital weather gang and the uh, folks i've been uh, watching have done a really good job of communicating this not over hyping it and having us uh having us ready <laughs> yes we had a half an inch and nobody was uh, paying attention and it crippled the entire city here uh, two nights ago uh, you know, record long commutes, and so everybody's joking. How can we can handle half an inch? How are we going to be able to handle? How are we going to be able to handle the entire uh, the entire uh, 20 to 30 inches that are uh, being predicted for the jackpot? Some of the models last night were showing uh, 30 to 40. So uh, yeah, it was pure ice. It was it was really slippery. Uh, but we weren't ready for it, and despite all the communicating, we're ready. Yeah, yeah, big green egg. I got my. I'm gonna grill something tonight. Have to get a lot. Come on. That's a good choice. How many tickets you got? Where'd you go? 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 Yeah, yeah. I got, here, the, I got the food. Olivia, over here. Costco was also really well uh, organized right here. yesterday. I uh, think it would be insane. But it wasn't. They uh, did a nice job. Yeah, I'm, I'm not a drinker myself, so uh, I stocked up on uh, on Pete's coffee and uh, and uh, some expensive bubbly water. Yeah. 
Yeah, Richmond looked like it was going to get uh, the jackpot for a little while there. And uh, now... They were buying shovels for all their neighbors. Maybe that's, maybe that's it. But, uh, yeah, you, you, can't have, you can't have enough sleds. You know, the kids are going to fight on the sleds. And besides, they're going to go into snow drifts and you won't be able to find them. Ah, there you go. Cute. Cute snow shovel for them. Yeah, that snow's going to be taller than she is. Hold on one second. Be careful with that. Make sure you don't hit anyone. Daddy! Daddy! We're going to be broadcasting during the entire storm, so follow me for for uh, future updates. We've got the uh, measuring sticks. Yeah, start them out young. Hey, uh, I'm telling my teenage boy he can make a lot of money if he uh, has the wherewithal to uh, shovel this weekend. Yes, I, I think you do need a yellow shovel, a red shovel, and a, you know, the warmer the shovel, you get sort of a sympathetic melting of the snow. It may shovel faster. Nobody wants to shovel with a blue shovel. Uh, it feels cold that way. Once again, we're outside of the Schroesnyder hardware store here in Bethesda. Uh, it's uh, lots of energy here. Uh, people out for about two hours till we're supposed to start. Uh, hello, Chicago. About two hours till we're uh, sort of start seeing our first flakes and then things start picking up a little bit, uh, a little bit later on. Yes, I'll get them. Seems a lot better. Uh, they, they got the ice choppers there. That's kind of a quite important uh, part of it, getting your car out. Yeah, I know it's not not that interesting, not that diverse. But uh, like I say, uh, we'll be uh, sending updates through the evening as long as the uh, power holds out. Yeah, good day to make some chili. All right, I guess I'll get back and feed the birds. Thanks for following, everybody.